Hello YouTube and YouTubers, it's iPod Apps Freak. What is going on guys? Today I have the tutorial on how to install Android 2.2 Froyo um, on your iPhone 2G or 3G. Now this is only available for your iPhone 2G and 3G. So if you want to get um, this installed on your iPhone, go ahead and open up Cydia. And you do need to be jailbroken for this and you do need to have Cydia available. Now this is not available for any other um, any other device except for the iPhone 2G and 3G, and it only supports um, jailbreaks, Red Snow, Ponage Tool, and Black Rain. That is all it that's all it supports for now. So it does not support jailbreakme.com, and it does not support um, Spare Jailbreak and all those other ones. So, once your Cydia has done um, uh, loading and stuff, go over to Manage, go over to Sources, you're going to hit Edit, Add, and then you're going to add this source right here. Um, Repo.NeonKoala, let me just type it here. So you guys understand repo dot neon koala dot co dot whoops dot uk. All right, so here is the source, and if you didn't get that source, it will be um, down in the description. So once you have added the source, go into the source. There is only one package in to, in the source which is called bootlace so this one this says idroid and open iboot tool uh, for your iphone so you want to install that of course i already have it so you're going to hit install and then once you have that go ahead and exit out of cydia alright so you're going to have this new icon called um, bootlace right there so go ahead and open up bootlace it will um, take a while if you first time uh, start bootlace because it has to patch the kernel and then it, you're going to be able to get to this screen so after it has um, patched your kernels and all of that so here it says notices compatibility compatibility um, iPhone 2G and 3G and red snow ponage tool and black, black rain black rain black rain and that's all it supports right now so first you want to go over to open iboot and this is the first thing you are going to be installing open iboot this is how it's going to look and all you're going to do is hit that install button right there and here it says warning bootless is about to install open iboot this involves flashing important parts of your d uh, device and must not be interrupted or your device will require a restore do not close the app during any part of the install connect your device to the mains before continuing so connect it to the connect your charger um, in case your battery dies because this is a long process so after you install open iboot which will only take about five minutes go ahead and over to idroid tab go over to the idroid tab here are the tabs on the bottom and you're going to install that so okay whoops I did not want to install that now it's crashing alright so once you install open or once you install iDroid which and once you install that and then you're going to go over to quick boot and you're going to tap on the android icon and it says warning this will reboot your device into android immediately do you want to uh, are you sure and you're going to hit yes i'm going to hit no right now because i do not have android installed on it anymore i took it off so if you want to take it off, um, you're going to go over to Bootlace, 
and first you're going to uninstall Open iBoot, then you're going to uninstall uh, iDroid, then you're going to exit out of the um, bootlace, then you're going to go over to Cydia, and then you're going to uninstall bootlace from there, which I'm going to do right now. <laughs> um, so that was how to install Android on your iDevice. Now this is currently only available for the iPhone 2G and 3G and if you try it for other um, devices it will not work, it will screw up your device and you will probably um, it will screw it up really bad so so that's one thing so I'm just gonna go over to manage sources and I'm gonna uninstall this modify Alrighty, so you do you do need to um, uninstall iDroid and open iBoot first because this will screw it up if you just remove it straight from Cydia. This will screw up your iDevice. So that was how to in install it. And if you guys um, thought, if you guys like this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe up there, and be sure to drop a comment down below and save it to favorites as it really does help me out. And thank you guys for watching. It's iPod Apps Freak, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.